Good morning. Yesterday, on July 28, 2016, the University of Education from the University of Da Nang honorably welcomed more than 350 participants, including scientists, educators, teachers, students, and parents from five countries to the fifth international conference on school psychology titled Developing School Psychology Worldwide, which promisingly brought numerous valuable studies on school psychology. The conference is held by the Ministry of Education and Training, MOET, the Consortium to Advance School Psychology International, CASP-I, and the University of Education from the University of Da Nang. Since its launch at the end of 2015, the conference has attracted a lot of attention from scientists, educators, teachers, practitioners, students, and parents. Interested parties were from 50 institutions of training and education nationwide and worldwide, hospitals, schools, and other organizations. At the conference, there were 72 published articles, 20 speeches, and 10 mini-skills presentations. So as you can see from the slide, we administer something called the After the opening ceremony, today. Professor Michael Haas fact, from Chapman University the made the first presentation during the keynote that session. There were seven presentations during the keynote session. They focused on the models of school psychology worldwide, how to orient and find solutions as expressed by MOET, the Ministry of Labor, Veterans with Disabilities and Social Affairs, and the connections among NGOs in the field of school psychology. I'm so happy to be here today and to see everything that the different groups, including the Ministry of Education and Training, the University of Da Nang, and CASPI are doing together to move forward in the field of psychology, to benefit children, and to bring our countries closer at the same time. Um, it's very inspiring to see what people are doing. It's great to see how much has happened in six years, and I cannot wait to see what happens in the years to come. In the afternoon, presentations were made at five sessions with six themes. The themes were presented and discussed according to the grade levels within the education system, including policies on developing school psychology, school psychology training, the practice of developing school psychology, the roles of the community and NGOs in advocating the development of school psychology, media for the development of school psychology, and parents' view on the development of school psychology. After each presentation, there were a lot of feedback, which increased the overall quality of the presentations. Uh, I think that uh, all of the presenters is good. They have to prepare uh, good and they have to uh, make all of about the uh, audience uh, feel better uh, after presentation. Uh, in my section, all of the person he uh, we want to choose say something about uh, the presentation. I, I think that they have to a uh, good duty and a good presentation, and I think that um, I feel happy when I have a chance uh, when I have a chance to join uh, in this presentation. The fifth international conference on school psychology also consisted of mini skills presentations. There were. 10 mini skills presentations by domestic and foreign experts. They provided the participants with the opportunity to share, connect, and apply school psychology practices to the real world. So um, my mini skills presentation will be on um, working with young children who have experienced trauma. Um, and of course there are many different definitions for trauma. Um, it can take many forms. But the focus of the presentation is on working with young children, children in preschool um, or kindergarten, early on. And as I said, I think prevention is very important. 
Prior to the fifth conference, the organizing committee held a gala dinner. This was a chance for participants to meet and exchange their culture. In addition, there were two programs for the participants to enjoy after a hard day of work on July 28th. These were the meeting between the guests and the students of the University of Education of the University of Da Nang and the field trip to Hoi An, Guan Nam Province. I hope several things. Um, one, one reason I travel from the United States is to meet partners and individuals not just from Vietnam but from other regions in uh, South, Southeast Asia. The second is because I work at a university, I try to promote uh, exchanges of students and faculty to work with colleagues from Vietnam and other countries. And the third reason is personal. I uh, was here uh, as a, a military person uh, early in my life uh, during the war and so I have a very special uh, place in my heart for Vietnam and the Vietnamese people. After the two days of serious work, the fifth international conference on school psychology was closed successfully on the morning of July 29, 2016. The issues related to school psychology faced by the modern society are profound. Thus, the solutions proposed in the conference are valuable. The Da Nang University of Education is honored to hold this international conference, the conference on school psychology uh, with the topics on developing school psychology worldwide. We hope that after this conference, uh, people, students, lecturers will find new motivation to continue their researches and their work on this field. And I hope also that after this conference, the community, the, the society will find here the, in Da Nang University of Education a very uh, useful address for health in this area. Thank you to everyone for your contribution to making a successful conference. The University of Education at the University of Da Nang invites all researchers and practitioners to collaborate with us in the future. We look forward to seeing you at the next conference and we wish you well on your travels home. <laughs>